வணக்கம் வெல்கம் டு அவர் கோர்ஸ் ஆன் ப்ரொடக்ஷன் பிளானிங் பிபி அண்ட் மெட்டீரியல்ஸ் மேனேஜ்மெண்ட் எம்எம் மாடியூல்ஸ் இன் எஸ்ஐபி எஸ் ஃபோர் ஹனா டுவெண்ட்டி டுவெண்ட்டி டூ வெர்ஷன் திஸ் கோர்ஸ் வில் இன்க்ளூட் த ப்ராக்டிக்கல் டெமான்ஸ்ட்ரேஷன் ஆஃப் எ டெடிகேட்டட் சிஸ்டம் ஃபர்ஸ்ட் ஐ வுட் லைக் டு தேங்க் ஆல் வீவர்ஸ் ஃபார் யுவர் கிரேட் சப்போர்ட் கிவன் டு தி எஸ்ஐபி பிபி அண்ட் எம்எம் கோர்சஸ் பப்ளிஷ்ட் ஏர்லியர் தெர் ஆர் கொரீஸ் ஃப்ரம் மெனி லேர்னர்ஸ் to publish the course with practical demonstrations in addition there were many requirements for online courses for pp and mm due to the time constraints i am not able to plan the online course so i thought to combine both requirements and started to work on this course with the demonstrations so it would complete a manufacturing process flow right from planning purchase production and inventory management so that it will be helpful whoever are interested in this course and based on your time and on your own speed of your learning this course is designed to learn not only sap transactions but also how they can be applied to regular day to day operations to improve the productivity of business processes okay fine let me introduce the goals contents of this course how the course is arranged and who can benefit in addition how the dedicated server will be used for this course and also for demonstration the goals of this course is to provide a deep understanding on plan to produce processes that is production planning and execution pp module and procure to pay processes that is materials management mm module learn how to set master data on processes for both these processes pp and mm modules understand how configuration is set in this pp and mm modules and also some places there may be integration with other modules to meet the business needs and learn how to support business processes with sap s4 hana especially in this pp and mm modules this course will focus on pp and mm modules through sap s4 hana 2022 version it will be published in english and tamil on every saturday and sunday in earlier pp and mm courses we discussed theory only in this course we will practice each theoretical point through a dedicated server that is s4 hana 2022 version to ensure a clear understanding of the practical transactions there might be contents already discussed in the sap pp and mm courses that may be repeated here we will run this course based on a business case that will be introduced soon as part of the business case master data will be prepared to cover various business processes discussed in this course more than just hearing and seeing these sessions listeners are strongly suggested to practice the learning the critical success factor of becoming an sap user or consultant is nothing but practice 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 when i insist on practice you need a system that should be a reliable one i hired an sap s4 hana system version 2022 specific to this course it will be a dedicated server so it will be fully used by the specific users and also it will be controlled by me and in case you hire a public system you may face many issues because there will be lot of people using the system they change configurations they change even your master data those changes will happen but here we will exercise some controls so things will be under our control you will find a system which will be user friendly for you to practice if you like to practice these courses the contents along with me you may hire the same system so we can practice as a team to support your practice i will share a set of master data to be managed by you so you can play with them to learn more if you need any support to monitor your activities to clarify your doubts you may post in the respective sessions comments section so i can clarify them regularly so this course is almost like an online virtual instructor course if needed a specific session will be prepared and published to clarify specific doubts
if you are interested in getting the access to sap s4 hana this 2022 system and the master data required you may reach me through the email info at vgrovian.com or through whatsapp at 80560-43364. i will give the service provider details and they will provide you access to the same dedicated system used by me and the commercials will be discussed between you and the service provider directly i am not involved in any of the commercials regarding this server but i will be ensuring the quality of data quality of the settings that are in the system but not in the commercials please be clear on this since the system will be used by dedicated users of this course there will be some guidelines on master data and business transactions and there will be restrictions on access to configuration please note the user specific master data will be shared only if you hire the system but you may refer to the master data that will be published in this course for practice in your own system at the same time users are advised and you will not be allowed to change any configuration in the system that is fixed for this course but you will be able to navigate through the configuration details and you will not be able to change them but you can go through any of the configuration details this is restricted to facilitate other users to use the system effectively and learn so that everyone will get full benefit if you need any configuration practice by yourself you may use your own system which you can hire separately from whoever the server you would like to have on a broad note we will cover the following contents in this course overview of business processes and functions overview of sap organization structure master data for sap production planning and materials management demand management mrp s and op long term planning capacity requirement planning purchasing activities inventory management production order execution analytical reports configuration concepts and some of the transactions through fury apps please note that the flow is arranged in a logical way aligning the typical business processes in a manufacturing organization and how during a project implementation things are set up so both the things are aligned here first we start with the introduction to erp sap how to navigate into sap what is the impact of sap in business introduction to pp and mm then we'll be discussing fundamentals of pp and mm like organization structure master data business case used in our course and then we'll go through in detailed discussion about material master in different views and then we'll discuss the pp related master data like a bill of materials production version work center routing and then purchasing related master data like business partner purchasing info record source list and then the planning concepts like demand management mrp and then purchasing processes like purchase request and purchase orders and then specific purchasing activities like subcontracting external operations scheduling agreement interplan transfer inventory management like goods receipt goods issue physical stock verification then production order related activities like creating releasing and execution of production orders capacity management and then standard configuration of pp and mm modules of course there will be a other topics which will be added as and when depending on the requirements raised by you so whatever the topics i just mentioned now those things were covered theoretically in our earlier pp and mm courses now we will see practical demonstration of these topics in addition to those topics covered here we will cover the following topics based on the requirements raised by various users in our channels comments section and directly by email or whatsapp to me like uh, in production planning we will discuss sales and operations planning long term planning demand driven mrp kanban in production in materials management we will cover release procedure kanban in procurement invoice verification integration with other modules like product costing sales order atp quality inspection and purchasing and production 
and then SAP implementation issues like a pre-implementation, implementation, post-implementation, post and then importance of documentation. Also, we'll be seeing the various transactions in Fury system. And for all these things, we need feedback from you and also the requirements raised by you then and there in the respective uh, the sessions, comment section. So it will help us to understand your requirements and create the new part of the uh, contents for this course. Who will benefit and how they will benefit from this course? For the people who are new to SAP, like the freshers, they can understand what is SAP. And also if they practice all the transaction here, they will be knowing the basic SAP transactions and they can attend any interview or if they want to take certification, they can also take it. For SAP end users and ABAPers, they can practice all the transactions which are explained here. They can also go through the configuration settings and they can practice different scenarios by changing the various parameters and master data so that they will be able to understand what is the impact of each parameter in the master data, how it is affecting the processes. For SAP power users and again senior ABAPers, they have to again practice all the transactions, go through the configuration settings. They can understand how the settings are done in the configuration and also each field in master data, how they are set and what are the different configuration facilities available for master data and also the different practical scenarios, how they can be applied into SAP. For SAP, PP and MM consultants, there are some practical explanations will be given in this course. And also they can understand how to link the business requirements because I will be also explaining some practical issues or the challenges I faced during my consulting experience with many companies so that they can also take some cue from this and they can apply them in their situations. Also, they can try various options in master data. Also in configurations, if they have any doubts, or clarification, they can raise so that they can be discussed and they can practice them in their system. Whoever is going through this course should get the full benefit. After completing this course, you should have improved your knowledge of SAP to the next level. For this, there should be systematic learning. Get the system suggested, use the business case, create all master data and start transactions along with me. As I mentioned earlier, the only success factor will be practice, practice, practice. Also, please raise your queries in the comment section of our channel. As mentioned earlier, they will be answered regularly. For any additional learning and clarification, of course, that should be done always. You may type in your query doubt on the internet and you will get instant answers. Some useful references are www.answers.sap.com, www.help.sap.com, or www.blogs.sap.com. Okay, let me introduce myself. I am Shanmugam Satyamurthy. You can address me as Satya. I am a consultant and trainer in supply chain management and SAP. I am an APIX recognized instructor for certified supply chain professional CSCP. Certified in Logistics, Transportation, Distribution, CLTD, and sub Supply Chain Operations Reference Professional, SCORP. In addition to being certified as CSCP, CLTD, and SCORP, I am certified as Demand Driven Planner Professional, DDPP, and Demand Driven Leader Professional, DDLP. I worked 13 years in manufacturing and production planning and control in the FMCG industry, 8 years in SAP consulting, project management, and delivery management and came back to operations management for seven years, managing supply chain management and manufacturing. Since April 2019, I have become a freelance consultant and doing training and consulting in supply chain management and SAP pre-implementation, implementation and post-implementation. Thank you for taking this course. Just to summarize, we just saw that SAP this course introduction, we saw contents and flow of this course who are the audience, how they can benefit, and also how to accelerate your learning. Once again, thank you all for your great support for our earlier PP and MM courses. We'll start the current course with introduction to ERP in the next session. 
for the new learners and for repeaters you may refresh your knowledge in the grp of course there are some new contents added there please give your feedback to improve the flow and contents also please suggest your friends and colleagues to subscribe to the channel so that they can also get the benefit from these knowledge sharing sessions and my whatsapp number and email id are given here to contact me and also if you want to have any other clarifications thank you see you in the next session take care bye